everyone, Mama Micah here, and today I am very excited because I went to Target and they finally restocked their World of Nintendo figures. I'm very happy about this. And starting off, we have got Red Yoshi. This is a Series 2-3 figure. Very happy to find the Yoshis. I absolutely adore Yoshi as a character, and I just haven't been able to find hardly any World of Nintendo figures lately. So being able to find a Red Yoshi is really fun for me. So opening him up. Oh, that was a noisy one. There we go. Oh, this one was easy to open. Look at that. Let me just pop. Oh, I spoke too soon. Let me just pop them out. Let me just. Oh, and the one, two. Uh. Hooray! So here is. The red Yoshi, I love his little blue shoes. The contrast is really great on this one. The colors are just so striking. I've always really liked the red Yoshi. And I believe his arms do move, which is nice. Always nice to have a little bit of posability in the figures. So that's really cool. I like that a lot. And another great feature too is that his mouth is actually carved out and he does have a little tongue in there. So once again, the details on these always impress me. I'm never disappointed with these little World of Nintendo figures. And this was especially thrilling for me because I finally found one of the 4-inch World of Nintendo figures. These are so hard to find where I live. So I was thrilled to find Cat Mario and it comes with the bell accessory. And on the back it says 4-inch figure with 14 points of articulation. So this one has a lot of posability. I was so happy to find this one because I've never seen the big ones where I live. I always just find the small World of Nintendo figures. And even online they're either wicked overpriced or the shipping's really high. So I'm very happy to have finally found one of these. And now to unbox. Let me just peel this back. And the pop. Oh, all right, the backing is gone. Okay. I'm removing the plastic tray. And so he has got some twisty ties on him. So we're going to take those off first. All right, so Mario is freed and he has a good weight to him. Nice solid feet as well. And it's got a lot of posability here because the tail moves not just back and forth, but it actually moves front and back. And on his gloves here, we've got some nice detail, really nice detail on the paws here. So I guess that's what I should call him is his paw gloves. I don't know. But his arm moves back and forth and again can be bent even further. And that's the same on both arms. And then his legs as well can be posed different ways. Oh, and he's got the little pink paw pads on his feet too. That is so cute. Lots of great detail on these. Of course, the head also turns back and forth. He looks awesome. I'm very happy to have finally found this. And I look at the accessory too. This is the little bell that was included. I really like when they include accessories with these. I believe the Yoshi came with a little egg. I think that might be the only big figure that I have because I forgot about my Yoshi with the egg. And I really like that. I love that they included a little accessory with it. So that was a quick unboxing of Red Yoshi and of Cat Mario. Let me know in the comments below if you have either of these or any of the other big figures. I really hope I can find more of these soon. Like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more, and I'll see you next time. Bye!